Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name's Jenny Jo, and this is part three of our $250 plus dollar Dollar Tree haul. And um, yeah, we're just about to wrap it up. So thank you guys for who stuck through this haul, part one, two, and three. If you haven't seen parts one and two, I'm going to try and link it in this little cards up here. And if I can't figure that out, I'll figure out putting it in the description box. It'll be in either one of those. So um, I hope you guys enjoy part three of my Dollar Tree haul. And let's get going. All right. So I also picked up three of these little tea light -like candle holders. You could do so much with these also. And I got three of the bigger ones. And I think they're supposed to be three sizes. But these are the only two sizes I've ever seen. But I'm pretty sure I heard other people talking about like other sizes. Um, I also got some of this reindeer moss for a project and some Spanish moss. And I found these um, Valero facial wipes. This is the honeysuckle and green tea. Everyone's been talking good things about them. And it smells good. So I haven't really tried it yet. Um, so we'll see what happens. And I got this little planter for a project. All right. So... These are kind of out there, but I got two of these wooden rolling pins. Um, I'm pretty sure these are real wood, and I just, I have an idea for these, so we'll see how that works out. And then, like I said, I have a three-year-old. His main things is Paw Patrol, Trains, Mickey, and PJ Masks. If you have little kids and you know who that is. Anyway, I found these velvet art posters of Mickey. I got this one. And then I found these glitter coloring, coloring sheets. And it's Mickey also. Um, I also found this two-sided dry eraser practice board. He is only three. But I just, I don't know. I've seen this and I thought this would be cool. I mean, obviously for later on. But, hey, I said, when you find an adult tree, you better buy it. Um, and then I got two of these contact marble paper. Contact paper. It kind of looks like marble or granite, I guess. More like granite. So... I want to use these for something. I'm not sure yet. And then I also got these flower prints, which are really pretty. And I also have an idea for these. So, and then I got, what's in here? Oh, bling wrap. I got a fuchsia, a gold, a diamond, and a red in the three. These are fives and this is a three. Oh, and another fuchsia. Oh, yep. See, I thought I did. And the other dream sign. And the other love sign. I'm just going to throw these up here so I know where they're at. With the rest of them. All right. And then I got a bag of these marbles and the, or glass gems. And these are like the bigger ones. They have the little ones and the bigger ones. And I actually have more of those somewhere around here for a project also. And then... I got one of these push light. I have a bunch of these. I got, I bought a mirror from Walmart and then I bought a bunch of these and I put it around the mirror and one actually stopped working. So I needed another one. So I got this one and it was hard to find this. I'm telling you what, cause they knew and improved them and they look different and everyone says that they're awesome and nicer than these ones, but I already have all of these ones and I really don't want to have to switch them all cause there's literally like 15 lights around this mirror. So I'm glad that I found that, but I have a feeling that more are going to go out and then I'm going to have to buy the new ones, but when that day comes, then that day comes. All right. Oh, I got some of these gem stickers, one in pink, one in blue, and one in silver, oh, two in silver, and then, which are the adhesive gemstone stickers, and then more of this adhesive diamond wrap. I got one, two, three, four, five of the gold in the turquoise, I guess you would call it. One fuchsia. One, two, three, one, two. And five, five of the silver. And then here's that other Skeeter beater in the blue. And see how it's, I didn't show the other one, but like it's the little, it says, you see that? Mason. It says mason on it. So it's like a little mason jar and they're so cute. So I can't wait to have to keep those. Oh, more of the tea light candle holders. Tea light and gems. One, two, three, four, five. 
I got seven of more of those. And then I found this little ducky washi tape and I thought it was just so cute. So I bought that. And then another one of these green locker bins. Oh, and I got this picture hanging kit. It has 55 pieces, it has 24 nails, and it holds 40 to 50 pounds. 40 to 50 pounds, 10 to 30 pounds, 10 to 10 pounds. That's weird how they put that. Anyway, <laughs> and then um, oh, 10 to 10 pound hangers, wire, six eye hooks, 24 clouds, and then one fills, and six crochets, I guess. I don't know. Some of that I couldn't explain, I couldn't pronounce, and I probably pronounced half of that wrong to begin with. Sorry about that. All right. Oh, the next thing is, oh, look how cute these birdies are. I got one in pink or purple, one in like a grayish silver in that design. And then I thought these were actually the same design and they're not, but I got one in yellow and one in blue. And I thought these were the same because I bought them at two different stores, but they're not. But that's okay. It'll work there for a project. And then I got this cute little guy. He's purple and pink. Couldn't resist that. I got a blue one. And then I got like a little navy with a purple feather. Furry. I thought they were cute and they're for a project. And then I got one of these LED color. This is the color changing one, 60 total hours. And then this is just a white one and it flickers. And it's one, 120 hours. So. These are all for a project. Oh, next thing. Yay. I knew there was more of these somewhere. Three more of the four by six of these Robin Blue like real wood picture frames. And then they had these hidden and I have been looking for these for a while now. And I found three of the circle mirrors. And I got plans for those, believe me. And they had them hidden. I, I could not believe when I found those hidden. I mean, they had them hidden by them big 11 by 14 mirrored picture frames. They were literally hidden. All right. Oh, and I got more of those four by six picture frames. Three more of those. It seems like the number is three. Like, I've, all, I've been finding three, three, and three of these picture frames, except for the five by sevens. I've only found, I'm pretty sure I've only found two of those, but the four by sixes, I seem to find them in three, so I don't know. And then I've never seen these like type of labels before, but I thought they were so pretty and like elegant looking. And I wanted to use these like in my pantry to um, label my containers or in my craft room or wherever. So I picked two of those up and there's 30 in each pack. And then I got three, four of these mirrored picture frames. And actually, there's more of them right here. Or no. Okay, so I got five in that style because these styles are actually different. Yeah. And then I got four in this just like thicker black border. And then there's, sorry, I don't want to blur you guys. And then there's just like this little more detailed border in black. So, got four and four, and then I got this one in silver. I actually had a couple more of them in silver, and I did a project with them, and I had one left over, so that's how that became to be. Because <sighs> I did the project already. <laughs> I did that almost immediately when I got them. I didn't think about doing a haul then. So I actually think I got six of those. No, I got seven in total and only needed six. And then I got a bunch of these two-piece chopping mats. And I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those. And I got these to put, I actually seen a YouTuber. Ooh, she actually is the one who um, suggested this idea to get these mats and you put them in the fridge. And then if something spills on them or... Just food getting on them. I mean, your fridge just gets disgusting after a while. It'll make cleanup just so much easier by taking these pads out and either cleaning them or just replacing them, which I thought was a bomb idea on her part.
I just thought that was a good idea. All right. The next thing I got was this round floral foam. It's a 7.9 inch by 1.5 inch floral foam. And then I got one, two, three, four more of the big gem beads. And then I got this pretty clear plate. I just thought this was so pretty, the design on it and stuff. So I got that. And that is all for a project. Actually, let me go here next because this is getting... Actually, I forgot about these. I found these too, the rose candle holders. Yep. I got three in the pink, three in the white, and then there's a red one. But I didn't get the red one. I didn't really care for the red one. I got three pink and three white. I'm sure that's the box that they gave me for them. Here. Oh, I got three packs of this blue decorative sand. I had been, I seen these one time, didn't get them because I wasn't sure. I had an idea, but I wasn't sure. And then now I have an idea and I was looking all over for these. These were the last three packs that they had. I'm so glad that I went to that Dollar Tree. And then it was my son's birthday Saturday and I got this um, birthday boy one. And I got a three-year-old one with like a star. And then I got just the regular three-year-old. And the star one had a happy birthday on it too. And then I had extra blue like metallic candles that I got from there. And um, anyway, I didn't end up using that one. So I figured I could save that for next year. Um, I got a little thing of Mod Podge. Now, to me, it's actually cheaper to buy it at Walmart. The bigger container for $5 instead of like these little two fluid out ones for a dollar. But... Somebody threw my little one away <laughs> and I like the little one because it's easier to like squeeze out when you want to squeeze it on something instead of just like, especially if I'm working with glitter, I don't want a bunch of glitter in my Mod Podge and I don't want to waste Mod Podge that I don't use because I put it in a bowl. So I'd rather have that, just one of them. So I got that and then I got these little packs of glitter. I always only ever seen this one. So I never actually got it, but then I seen all colors. So I got this one has like the white, I guess it would be like um, iridescent glitter, silver and black. And then I got like dark blue, light blue, greens in that pack. And then these are like gold and bronzy colors. And then this is pink, reds, and purples in this one. So I figured for a dollar, these were like decent packs of glitter. I mean... I had an idea for these, but I don't know if I'm going to have enough, so we'll see about that. And then I got two more, two of these pink little organizer baskets that I love so much. I think that them ones, the little woven, the woven, the weave through them, they have like the woven, the weave look. I don't know. I can't say what I'm trying to say, so I'm just going to, you guys know what I'm talking about. You guys know. Oh yeah, and then I finally found the sea glass. I was so happy to find out I got I got seven of these, which I actually have an idea for those two. All right, I got one of these laundry baskets. I actually got two of them. There's another one with a bunch of stuff in. But I finally found this. These are the mirror stickers, and um, I always only see friends. And um, I think there's another one, but I can't remember it. I could never find the family. Or if I would find the family, it was like real like chewed up and crappy. So I finally found a decent one and I'm so happy. I'm so happy I have plans with that. This I couldn't believe to find. This is PJ Mask. And I could not believe I found this at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. My son loves this, so I can't wait to put that up in his room. They had these cute little signs there. They had this pink one that says love, which was my favorite because I'm obsessed with pink. And they had like a green one that I think said imagine and like a more black wood one looking one that said hooray, I believe. It was something like that, but um, I like the pink one out of the, all of them. I got this foil black splash wall sticker and I actually have, I'm not going to use this as a backsplash. I would not use this as a black backsplash, but 
I actually have an idea for this and I'm not sure how that's gonna work, but it's for my kitchen like under the sink. I don't know, we'll see how that goes. And then I found some more wall stickers. I found these cute little flamingos and it's like has like the rose gold like shimmer to it, shine to it, so I like that. And then I found this one, it's supposed to be a little heart, a birdie heart with flowers and I thought that was so cute. And then I found the Eiffel Tower with Paris on it. And I thought this would look cute either in this room or in my beauty room. And then I found these ones of the alphabet. Now, I've been wanting to get these for a while. And the only ones that I could ever find were the, um, were the ones with the, um, were the girly looking ones. And I have a boy. I don't want girly looking stickers. You know what, I'm, what I mean? Like, I don't want girly looking stickers. So... I finally found the boy ones and it took me four different stores before I found all three of these. So, but I'm glad I found them all because I'm going to do like his name, have enough to do his full name on his wall and to do the alphabet. So, I'm glad I found those. All right. Ooh, these I was really happy to find. Again, some of these he's probably too young for, but some of these I feel like we should be okay on. Um, especially the ones like this one. It's pre-K, same or different. So, it's like they find like they do little activities and find which one's different find the same you know stuff like that and then there's an alphabet one and these are from Crayola this one doesn't say an age group but I know he's too little for that but we'll be there soon enough this one says preschool phone so I thought he'd be okay with this one soon but I mean circle these objects in the in the picture so I mean stuff like this he should be I mean this will help with his skills so I was pretty happy with that colors he sh this I mean this would be a good one for him right now to do the colors and it's with Elmo so I was happy about that I found a Crayola color one I couldn't decide which one I like better so I just got both of those and then a numbers 1 to 12 which should also be another good one for him it says for preschool so I mean not so much maybe with like the like the drawing and write spelling that out at three years old but who knows maybe I have a baby genius <laughs> and then I found numbers and counting with Mickey the Roadster Racers and then this one is my favorite of them all I was really shocked to see this and I was not going to leave without it it is for kindergartners so I have a couple years to go but it's a test prep workbook and math language arts for kindergarten kids so I thought this was pretty neat it's actually like a test I mean, how crazy is that? And it has the answers in the back. I don't know. I just thought this was really cool, and I wanted to get it. So, because I figured by the time he is in kindergarten, it won't be there anymore. So, I got it. Um, next, I got some dry floral foam, and it comes in the four sec little sections. I got some more moss, but this is the floral moss instead of the reindeer moss. Oh, a metal truck, a little truck. This actually goes in his gift bag. I'll explain that in a minute. Oh, I found these little, um, this was not a good bag to put the moss in. I'm going to put the moss in there. I that's not a good bag, but it's all over my bath bombs. I found these cute little bath bombs, and it doesn't say the scent. And you can't really smell through the bag, so I don't know how good this smells or anything, but I thought it was cute. It's like a little ice cream cone or a milk. I thought it was a milkshake, but it has like the little cone marks in it, so I'm guessing it's like a little ice cream cone. I thought it was so cute. And then I got, I also got a heart one like that. And again, you can't smell it, and it doesn't say the scent, so we'll see what it smells like. We'll see what it's like. And then I found, oh yeah, I found this little Zoom Zoom. Oh! <gasps> washi tape and I just thought that was so cute so I had to grab that and then I got this heavy duty two times as strong duct tape um now this stuff is no joke like this is heavy duty um if you need some heavy heavy duty duct tape that is what you need girl because I have bought that before and that is some strong strong duct tape and then I got these little burlap ribbons one in pink and one in green I think the pink one is so cute I got the green for something and right now I don't remember what it was but I got it for something oh and then 
I got, I love getting these. I get these all the time. I mean, for a dollar, they do their job. They work. I mean, it's not the greatest of quality, but they work and you can just throw it away when you're done. So no big deal. Um, oh, I got another one of those flower lights. And then I couldn't believe I found this though for, um, if you have the Samsung, um, the Android S8 or S8 Plus or anything like that. I don't think, yeah, just the S8s. It, you need this new adapter now to use like the micro, um, the micro USB cords. So Dollar Tree has those. So I bought four of them. I was like, yes, please. And I bought one before and it worked. So I found more and I bought them. I got another tea light holder and they're 120 per tea light candle and they're 120 hours and then oh, I finally found the nautical rope so I got three of those I've been looking for that plenty of things in mind for that I got this contact paper in like the wood grain in the dark and the lights because I'm not sure which one I like better but we'll see oh I got another bolero facial wipe throw that in there So I got another Valero facial wipe. Yeah, let me get this out of here because there's moths. I have these now. <laughs> oh my gosh. Valero facial wipes. And then I got these red, these satin red pillowcases. There's only one in here. I thought there was two, but there's not. There's only one in there 20 inch by 30 inch. And I just had, I have an idea for these. So I got that. Some zip ties. This is a 60 piece zip tie. 7.5 inches and then I got this wire set you get six wires in it I normally buy the floral wire and then I seen this and I was like I mean I'm sure this is the same kind of wire I don't know I mean it's a better deal you're getting a little bit in the floral wire for a dollar instead of getting six for a dollar so I decided to get the six this is just coming apart but I got a set of these markers and I think I have another one somewhere and then I got these silver picks. I have an idea for this, or DIY. And I got another acrylic gem. I don't know how that one just ended up in there. Oh, and another pink burlap ribbon. Here's <laughs> I can get to the next thing. All right, guys. I think we got one more basket. This one that you've been seeing this whole time, so I got another basket. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's do these first since there's light enough to show. But I got a bunch of these flowers. These are, I don't know. But that's what those are. And I got it in white and this pretty bluish purple color. Two of those pretty bluish purple colors. <laughs> and like a darker purple. And then I got these, which are Larspur, which I actually already took the thing off of those because I had an idea for it. I wanted to see if it worked. I actually got three of these glass bottles, and I wanted to see if them flowers would fit in there, so that's what I did with those. But I got three of them glass bottles, which I think are so cute. And then I got these, which are called Queen Anne's Lace, but they remind me of, like, baby's breath, and they're purple, so I thought those were pretty. I got yellow roses and pink roses and I know I bought purple roses in there somewhere so they're around here somewhere but yeah my my flowers are getting squished though so I'm gonna throw these over here so they don't get squished anymore oh there's the purple roses I don't know how that happened but here's the purple ones I knew I had purple somewhere because I knew I bought them three colors but oh and then the large I got them in the blue and the in the white. I bought three white and six blue. And that. Here's another two. Look, one of them like tub containers, I guess. <laughs> you could call it. Where put that at? Oh. Oh, here's some more. Oh no, I left a little bit of fire. But anyway, I got these ferns. And then I got these little white ones. And these are called gypso. So they're actually called name something different than the purple one. So like that. And then I got these um another set of these. 
in the red, no off in the containers. I should the blue ones. And I got a three pack of these white containers. Um, oh, I got these little Sure Fresh containers and lids. I never have too many of those. These little shot glasses, I have an idea for those. I got these little removable hooks. Um, I bought the oval ones from Dollar Tree. And I tried to put my son's potty on it, and it just kept falling down. So I'm hoping that these square ones will work better in our bathroom so the potty's not all over the floor. But, and then I got these game towers. I have a crack with that. I got these little things that I had an idea for them. They're containers, and they're a dollar a piece. And they snap in together like this, but they don't, they don't like, they don't stay together very well. I don't know. They're really weird. So what I wanted them for isn't going to work, so I'm going to try them with something else, I guess, because what I wanted for isn't working. And then I got two of these little, ba they look like little waste baskets, and I already put one in my laundry room, so I think these are cute. I have to find a place for that one. And then I got these little things that I like to put in my drawers, and it comes in a three-pack. And I think this one, yeah, this one was a bonus. It used to come in two, and now it comes in three. I just said that. All right. Oh, look what I found. <laughs> Three more of them picture frames. <laughs> the four by sixes. I told you, I always find these in threes. I don't know why, but I always find these in threes that when I go to the store. So there's three more of those. Oh, I got this little balloon pump. Because it was my son's third birthday Saturday. And anyway, it works really good. It works really, really good. Actually, I mean, my hand got tired after a while, but it worked. It's nice. It does the job. So he had fun with all the balloons and we popped them all out. So they're gone. But anyway, oh, I got one of these um, suit storage bags and I actually seen this from another YouTuber. Um, you actually, what she did was she hung these, put it on a, um, a hanger and she hung it in the closet and she put like her extra wrapping paper in it and I thought that was just such a good idea so that's what I got oh I forgot I got this this 4th of July burlap ribbon it's just like the um ribbon that I got but it's just it's the bow so I thought that was cool and I didn't have to spend forever making the bow um oh I knew I had more of this more diamond wrap purple and silver and then I never seen yarn and I finally seen yarn. And I just thought this was really cute. I don't know what I'm going to use it with. But I was really excited to find yarn. And I thought that this was cute and really soft. <coughs> Excuse me. And nice. So I bought one of those. I just had to. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. But I got it. We'll see. I'll find something. And then I got this pink duct tape pad too. It's pink. Explains it all. Um, I got this 48 pack of crayons. And then I got two of these colored pencils. I got two of these neon ones too. Got other ones here somewhere. Yep, here it is. Two of the neon. Pencil sharpeners, of course. And then I got, I found these two, these double-sided markers. One with the fat end and one with the skinny end. So we'll have to see how those are. I have another one of the markers. I knew I did. And then I put this one in here. And then I got these adult coloring books. That's why I got the colored pencils for. My sister likes the color too, so that's why I got double. But anyway, I found these adult coloring books. This one gives me like a 70s vibe with that van on it. And it's just, I don't know, it's so cute. There's cute little things in there. Like look at the pineapple and stuff. Like it's a cute little book. I liked it. And then I got this one, Color Paradise, and it just has a bunch of cool pictures in it. My sister already started coloring this one. <laughs> and then we got this stained glass one, which is nice. It reminds you of, like, church stained glass, but it's, I mean, it's pretty. You can color it to look really pretty, especially with, like, some neon crayons and stuff. And then I got this for my son. It's Sparkle Art. It comes with um, some markers, and it's just sparkly backgrounds and color in it so I thought that was cool I actually bought two of them and he already he already did one yeah he's three so he already did one <laughs> that was his version of coloring and then he was done after that so it kept him quiet it kept him occupied for about five minutes so that's five minutes 
I won't complain. <laughs> five minutes is five minutes. All right. And then we're just about done. This is just the last bag. Yay, we're just about done of part three. This is the last bag. Um, and what this bag is, like with this car, is that I tell you in a minute, um, we do, we're doing a potty chart. Um, we're having a hard time getting him potty trained. So if you mamas or daddies out there have any any advice for me, I will take it. I will take any advice that you have because oh, I don't know what I'm doing and nothing I do is working. So anyway, I started, a, I made a party, potty chart uh, actually out of <laughs> Dollar Tree um, poster board and markers and stuff. And I made a potty chart and I got um, Mickey stickers. And every time he goes to the potty, he gets his stickers. If he goes number one, he gets one sticker. If he goes number two, he gets two stickers, which he hasn't gone number two yet. So anyway... So what I did was I, when I find stuff, I buy it and I put it in this bag and this is what he gets to choose out of. So I got this car is one of them. And then I found this little sun catcher and it's a dragon and I thought it was cute. He's like all into dragons right now. So when I see now I got it and then I found some Zoom Zoom. So I got this one and it has the little Olaf, the middle is the Cheshire cat and then the big bing bong. And, um, he actually has already got two sets of these in. He's seen them, so I gave them to him. So now I gotta get a couple more <laughs> for his potty chart. But and then here's the second one. It has a little grumpy, a Buzz Lightyear, and a Winnie the Pooh. And I wish I could find more of these because I'd really like to find more of these. And last but not least are these little softball um or these baseball faces. And I open it to show my husband. He wanted to see what they look like. And they're actually not bad. They're like a foam, but it has like um this is foam backing, but this is like a plastic top. So it has the first base, the second base, the third base, and then it has the home plate, and it has the pitching rubber. So I don't know, for a dollar, it's cute for kids and like for them to play, him and my husband and me or whatnot, to play softball with with his new baseball bat. So I thought it was cute, so I got it. But anyway that's the end that's the end of my haul that was this was part three of my three-part haul <laughs> and boy it was a long haul and um hopefully i'll have this up to you guys tomorrow which would be tuesday and um yeah and i'm gonna try and get them all up like real close together i'll try and get them all up tomorrow if not i'll have two up tomorrow and one up wednesday um but yeah, if you guys enjoyed this haul, please, please give me a thumbs up and so let me know that you like it and I will do more of these hauls. Give me some comments down below and let me know what you guys want to see and that's what we'll do. We got beauty, we got crafts, we got Dollar Tree hauls, Dollar Tree shop with me. Whatever you guys want to do, let me know and we can make it work. We can we can get it going. We'll get it going, guys. But um, thank you guys for being here with me and spending your time with me and I really hope you guys enjoyed my haul. If you do, remember, give me a thumbs up. Please, please, please give me a thumbs up. Because then I know. That makes me know that you guys like it. And then I know what to get, what to put out. So um, just um, let me know, guys. And I hope you guys enjoyed my haul. And have a good night. Love you guys. Bye.